Hey YouTube fam. Well, actually I'm coming to you today with a little video from a different location. We know no know we do. But these are called hibiscus. I just picked them from my roses from my edging. These are what is considered as hibiscus. So there are some people that are saying hibiscus and sorry they're all the same. And I know you have watched my sorry videos where I showed you. If you have not yet watched them, I'm gonna link up those videos from the cooking channel and you go watch them, you'll see what sorry looks like. So after I'll be I'll be turning on some water to boil from I'm gonna be treating it as you do saril you're gonna put the water to boil actually i'm just gonna put it with some cinnamon leaf because i don't have ginger here so you know when i put the ginger the cinnamon leaf and all of them look a something there so i am going to be i have about two about two cups of water two and a half cups of water in here i have seven petals of um hibiscus so what i'll be doing i will be moving these this part here this is definitely this is i'm gonna be removing this and i'm gonna be removing this, which is that i'm gonna be removing these so they will look like this when you see me next so i'll be rinsing them off i'll be using seven of them pulling out this part right here yeah getting it out picking off right here that is how i'll be doing it okay so i'll be having seven of these i'm using seven to two cups of water and i'll be using about three cinnamon leaves so i'm gonna wash the cinnamon leaves finish get off the petals off the rest of the hibiscus clean them up and make them look like this i'm gonna rinse them by the time that happens this water will be boiling i'll be putting in there leave it to steep for about 15 to 20 minutes when we come back we're gonna strain it you're gonna look at it i'm gonna drink some i'm gonna tell you i know the taste of it but i'll still try to explain to you so when I catch you back, you'll be seeing me putting them in there. When the water is boiling, we are treat it just like the sorry. So you can tell me, I want you to tell me if after this video, you think that hibiscus, this is our Jamaican hibiscus. I don't know what else, but they're pretty though. We always use them to make little stuff. When we were kids in the country, going to school as little girls, we would put them to the side of our ear. Then I didn't know that that's something we could have did make tea. You know, so I catch you in the next clip. Okay, now Paris. So my water is boiling. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put in my cinnamon leaves, just as with sorrel, and I'm gonna put in. If I had ginger, I would put the ginger in. And bear in mind that I'm using an electric pot as opposed to my regular pot at home. We're gonna cover it, and it is automatic. It will shut off very soon. So. I'll see you in the next clip. I'm going to leave it after it stops boiling. You can see what is happening in there. This is not how sorrel operates. So, no. we'll turn it off. Yeah. So, I'm going to turn it off right there now. So, I'm going to let it stay there and steep. Normally, we do sorrel overnight. But in the interest of time where I am, and you see what is happening. I'm going to leave it to steep for about 25. I'm going to give it half an hour. Yeah. And when I come back, I will strain it i let you see and you can tell me in the comment section if you think that hibiscus plant and the sorrel petal or the sorrel plant is the same thing so okay now youtube fam it's still warm really like not hot hot you know a little more than warm but we are gonna throw it out and show you four of us are here uncle murphy dad ma'am bosho and myself so first thing i want you all to look at what is coming down I want to show you something i want to look at the i want you to look at the petals we're not having a little strainer so bear with us on this video this is the end product of the petals i leave it up to you to tell me when you dry your sarin and you strain it as for the petal look what i think you see gentlemen i think <clears throat> it's nowhere near it the the sarin is something totally different it the strength the flowers is different. What do you think about shoe? Yeah, uh, 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 and the um, so me pour out some. Let you see. So me pour, make everybody get, yeah. Have a little sugar in each cup. Yeah. I try to get out these petals out there. Remember, I'm showing you the petals. You know, let me see number four. See there. All right. And this is fresh, fresh, um, 
fresh hibiscus just pick we just pick them we couldn't carry out when we are picking because where, where we are the weather is bad rain is coming on and off okay so we pour out for four people yes is my cinema leaving there is it uncle murphy yes we'll get out the answer okay we never have no ginger we probably want ginger but nevertheless that must stop you from get the flavor hmm? True. okay so gentlemen take a cup bow shoe come take a cup we're going to retreat it as tea it's warm but it doesn't matter you can still get the flavor so you all see the color okay so family bow shoe has gotten is uncle murphy dad and me let me take up mine everybody i got okay. tears uncle murphy tears and tell me everybody I'm here going to sorry already and and tell you how it is. Okay, Parry? Well, to me, it doesn't taste like saril. It has a little taste. Oh, I, I, I mostly taste the um, cinnamon. But it's, it's like a nice tea to drink. That's what I, my opinion. Okay, bon show. Well, uh, we taste that is uh, the cinnamon. And you see, we never use a lot of cinnamon. Mm -hmm. it, do you think that if we, gentlemen, do you think that if we had used a few pads of sorrel, it would taste the same? Would it that you taste the sorrel over the cinnamon? Of course. Would, would you say yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. All right, Dad, yes, would you say yes. that? Yes. Yeah, man. You, would, if we had used sorrel, you would have tasted the taste of the sorrel over, over the, the cinnamon. cinnamon. That oh, means, yes. as I did say in the prior mm -hmm, clip, mm -hmm. the sorrel is stronger. Right. All yes, right. Yes. Yeah, yeah. what do you think about it as a tea show? Well, that's why you try it next time. All right. Mm -hmm. Let me taste now. This is not my first time. I'm having it, but to be honest, it's. I think it's a nice tea, mild. It's a nice, mild. It's a tea. mild yeah, tea, yeah, yeah. mild. Mm -hmm. A little ginger to it. I don't think ginger would have done not much to this. What do you think, no. Boshu? No, 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 no. mm -hmm. All right, that is no, behind the camera. No, that tea is and tell us. I think that this would be a nice mild mm -hmm. tea. And to where we are, the rain is falling. And everybody is chilly. Everybody, I drink up them tea as you can see. We're waiting on yeah. Dad. Milk? Yeah, I think we'll put milk in at this. If you have ever tasted um I discussed tea, tell me if you would have put milk in there. I wouldn't put milk in this. Most of them would have put milk. Would you put milk in this, Uncle Murphy? No, you know, you drink just as it's, it's mild. Just mild. Like just a mild, mild tea. Yeah, that way you think. Yeah, it is mild, you know. Like a it, tea bag. Yeah. I wouldn't say tea bag, but the most of all um the taste in this is the cinnamon. Mm -hmm. And is, we did not put a lot of cinnamon. Yeah, 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 yeah. We did not put a lot of cinnamon. The hibiscus, you're not tasting it. No, mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. it is mm -hmm. like it's it more like very it's flat, very, very flat. flavorless. Mm -hmm. Very mm -hmm. flavorless. Yeah. So Parry, this is the end of it. So I would like you to tell me in the comment section if you have ever had hibiscus tea. I've had sorrel tea. Remember, we we'll use sorrel as a drink, but it is very beautiful as mm -hmm. a tea to have it warm. So if you have ever had sorrel or if you, and if you have ever had hibiscus, you can tell me if they have anything in common. If you have never had them, but you have seen, and I'm telling you, I'm going to link up the video that we did for sorrel. Tell me what you think about it. I've showed you the color. I have asked people to taste test and they have given their honest opinion. And I think I've, this is the third time I'm having it. I think what they say just makes sense. It is mild. Mm -hmm. No flavor. No flavor. No flavor. So, and until I see, thanks for watching, thanks for supporting, continue to support and continue to show love. And until I see you again on this camera, it's going to be what, Dad? I discussed tea the last time you said it's going to be jackfruit. <laughs> <laughs> see you again. Yeah, bye, bye, bye family, bye. Mary.